When you move to the countryside, it's with the hope of spending more time outside, to get out of the cubicle and into nature. And I believe I'm doing a pretty good job at it so far. Except outdoor bathing in January. That f***ing sucks b So I got myself a movable outdoor bathtub, or as many of you would call it, a loader bucket for the tractor. Hi, I'm E, and I make videos about starting a farm from scratch here in Norway. If you're into that stuff, consider subscribing and maybe give it a thumbs up at the end. I have a new loader bucket and during this video, I will definitely try and take a bath in it. I got the bucket from an old retired farmer not far from here. It had only been standing in his backyard for many years and he needed the space for something else. Stuff were growing on it, so I decided to get it proper clean. When you buy equipment for a front loader, there are different systems who uses different connections to attach the equipment to the loader. And for my loader, you need these hooks to attach it. That means if the bucket has different hooks, you either find a new bucket or attach new hooks. Now I'm so fortunate that I know a welder. His name is Sigge, he's from Iceland and he's awesome. Sigge said buy the bucket and he'd remove the old connections and hooks and attach new ones that fit. Now I can't have a video with Sigge without some slow motion, so here's the Sigge sequence. He always gives 100 year warranty on the weld and he does an amazing job. So this time I thought it'd be a good idea to give him something extra. These days photos are usually seen only on a screen. So I thought it'd be cool to making something he can hang on the wall in his shop. If he wants to. I hope he likes it though. Uh, the bucket's first task will be to straighten out the driveway. I've had a lot of heavy trucks with the rocks and gravel drive up and down and I need to straighten it out so it won't scratch under my car when I drive.
kind of crazy that's the middle of the winter and I'm leveling out the driveway instead of uh, moving snow. Usually we have 10, 15 minus degrees Celsius uh, and a lot of snow. But this year the guys who get hired to move the snow and uh, the people selling firewood isn't making a lot of money. Well, we still have a lot of winter left so I'm pretty sure that I will have some snow. But then I'll have my bucket and uh, I'll be prepared. It has some scratches and dents in it but that's okay as long as it works. Here's a couple of more jobs I will use it for. Now the best thing with having a bucket like that, that my body won't suffer anymore. The tractor and the bucket will take a huge load off and I don't have to pay as much money to the chiropractor and the acupuncturist as I usually do. So, so this is all good. Now a bucket like that doesn't have to be all business, it can also be pleasure and recreational activities like baseball.